The largest planetary spacecraft NASA has ever made just began its very long journey to Jupiter. Only a few days ago, SpaceX's Falcon Heavy launched the Europa Clipper spacecraft. Interestingly, using SpaceX in this rocket was not NASA's first choice. Originally, the agency was planning on using the Space Launch System, or SLS rocket, but ran into a few issues. These main issues being high cost, low availability, and a violent shaking during launch thanks to the solid rocket boosters that could damage the spacecraft. The only downside of the switch is the fact that it'll take longer for the spacecraft to reach Jupiter using Falcon Heavy. In total, Europa Clipper will travel 1.8 billion miles, or 2.9 billion kilometers, over more than five years to reach Jupiter in April 2030, using gravity assists of two other planets to help it accelerate towards Jupiter. Now that it's launched, it'll first head toward Mars, coming to within 300 to 600 miles of the surface, then slingshot back toward Earth, coming about 2,000 miles from the planet. Through these gravity assists, Europa Clipper will achieve the velocity needed to reach Jupiter by the end of the decade, where we'll study one of Jupiter's moons for possible life.